just wanted to come on here real quick and say that today is Drake's birthday, so we're going to be, well, I'm going to be doing a quick little film um, and just celebrating his life and existence. He's going to be six years old. Okay, so he's six years old today, and so I'm going to get some coffee, and yeah, that's one, that's the first step. Get some coffee, maybe take him for a walk, and get him some treats today, so that's what's on the agenda, so stay tuned. Say hi. It's Drake's birthday. <laughs> How old is he? He's old. How old is he? Come on, Drake. He wants to be on the vlog too. It's cold outside. Drake, hurry up. All he does is go over there and bother the neighbor's dog. Hurry up. Okay, so first things first, I have to have my coffee before um, I can go for a walk. Before I can do anything at this point in my life. The craziest thing though is I used to always drink um, the pre-made kind that is the Starbucks brand. Um, the cold brew and now it doesn't even work for me so yeah but anyways Drakey Drake he knows something's going on he's so excited <gasps> so excited <laughs> to go for his walk how do you feel birthday boy Okay, so yeah, he knows something's going on. I gotta hurry up. He gets really impatient when he knows that he's going for a walk. And this is how he gets. Usually any other time he's really quiet. But now, he's ready. He's ready. He's ready. <laughs> All right, sounds like breakfast is ready. And I call it that because I'm gonna have to use it to stave off this hunger. Um, it is eight o'clock and Daniel has a um, haircut later on today and after that we'll be um, getting breakfast so I'm gonna just drink this real quick and I know y'all can hear Drake crying in the background now because now he's all hype because he know he's going on a walk so I have to hurry up I'm also gonna add this natural bliss almond milk creamer it's plant-based um, and the reason I chose to do plant-based is because if I'm consuming things frequently like daily then I'm going to want it to be as healthy as possible I know there's probably like sugars and stuff but I didn't want to do a whole lot of dairy so this is actually really good though this is the vanilla flavor also I like cold coffee so I'm just gonna add the ice Okay, we're back from our walk and um oh it was it was a little chilly outside so um you know season change so I have this little sweater on but Drake loved it we got a little photo shoot so I'll put some of the pictures um I'll put some of the pictures in the in the video <laughs> but he had a blast so that's the first part of his birthday and it was so cute because on our way back home, like we just did like a lap around the neighborhood. So on our way back home, um, as I told y'all, my husband, he had to go get his hair cut and we saw him and he's so dramatic. He <laughs> rolls down the window and was like, happy birthday, Drake. <laughs> so Drake was really excited. It was hilarious. I should have recorded it, but you know, whatever. I missed that opportunity. But yeah, he's tired now. Drake, you tired? He's tired. 
So we're going to go and we're going to go get him some, some treats. We're going to go get him some treats. I think he'll enjoy that. <laughs> you going to enjoy that? And don't mind the mess in the background. Um, usually I clean up on the weekends because, you know, your girl be busy. It's a busy lifestyle, you know. I've got 10-hour shifts now because of uh, COVID. But also, it's a long weekend. So I am looking forward to that, doing some deep cleaning. And I also want to, like, warm my house up a little bit um, because of fall. So I have some decor out, but I kind of want to go shopping. So for that, I'll probably bring you all along um, just to make it a little bit more festive. I feel like in my old age, I have become more of a homebody. First of all, I've always been a homebody. But now it's to the point where like I'm changing my decor for every season. Okay. Um, but yeah, so I'm really excited. I kind of have a couple little things I'm not going to show y'all right now because my house is a mess. Okay, and y'all not about to be talking about me. I can come on here bald face. However, what I won't do is have y'all in a messy home. No, my mama raised me better. Oh, and speaking of my mama, um, I'm gonna take this little opportunity to brag on her. I'm so excited, y'all. Um, like I said in my first video, it's 2020, so we're trying new things, right? Um, and we are we're doing things that we probably wanted to do for the longest and uh we're finally just just taking the initiative and we're jumping in so around the same time that I started my vlog my mom has started a podcast she's always been interested in just motivating um and encouraging people and it's a Christian podcast uh so I, I enjoy it you know it, it will help me in my daily walk but Y'all, she put a spin on it. So if you're interested in listening in, you can find her on Spotify. Uh, it's Grace Pace. So when I was doing my walk, I listened to her second um, episode. And I'm really proud of her because she has been pushing those episodes out. So um, yeah, check her out. Grace Pace on Spotify. Oh, oh and I'll see, I'll see y'all later. Um, I'm about to go change and get kind of cute because, um, yeah. You is six. You is six. You is six. Drake is six. Ay, ay. Drake is six. Ay, ay. Birthday boy. Drake is six. Drake is six. Ay. <laughs> Don't be sniffing up on me. I know I need a shower. Back up. Back up. Back up. Okay, you got anything you want to say to the people? Drake is six. Drake is six. <laughs> Drake, what you want to say? All right, y'all. I'm going to go for real. Looky, looky where I got you, Drakey. What is in there? What's in there? Let's see. What you get? Ooh, yummy treats. So we got him a happy birthday bone. And what else did we get you, huh? Let's see. <gasps> Look, a new toy. Yay! He loves these things. He loves them. So we got him that. What else? I love putting Drake in little festive costumes. So we're gonna do a little photo shoot. And then that will probably conclude the rest of his birthday. All right. All right, let me open up some of his treats. So it's safe to say, I think he likes it. Birthday boy approves. <laughs> Is it yummy? Oh, yeah, he does like it. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> but, child, he is enjoying this. Look at him. Look at him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Happy birthday, Drake. Happy birthday, Drake. He's six today. Yummy. All right, I'm probably gonna have to take, oh. Dang, as soon as I thought I was gonna take it from him, he took it from me. I guess I'm gonna have to sneak it from him because he can't eat this whole thing. All right, y'all, I am back on here. This will probably, probably be the last and final segment that I filmed today. Sorry, I'm trying to like get centered. Um, But hopefully you've enjoyed what we've filmed thus far with Drake's birthday. I thought he was gonna join me. However, I think he's more interested in um, boxing because my husband is downstairs watching boxing. So he decided to excuse himself. So birthday boy is gone, but um, we have his little hat with us here. <laughs> Uh, I just wanted to say a few last words and I know some of y'all are probably like why are you making such a big deal <laughs> about your dog's birthday um, and I'll tell you why. So I in the past I didn't think it was a big deal either however last year around this time I remember Drake just started acting out like <laughs> really bad and he was becoming disobedient, he was barking at us, and he was just um, just not himself. And so we ended up, well, like I ended up just so happened that I looked at his paperwork for whatever reason, because I think I was looking for like his shot records or whatever. And I was like, oh my God, like it's his birthday. So, he um we didn't realize it. it it was like a couple days later but after we took him to like the um we took him to the groomers you know we pampered him we got him some treats and we got him like this new little dog collar and after that he was fine i think he just wanted to be loved on and celebrated so we did that and once we did he was back to his normal happy-go-lucky self. So because of last year, we made it a point this year and from here on out, we are going to celebrate him. Um, and just because he's a joy to our lives, like he really brings um, just happiness to our lives. He's a part of our family. And so that is why I'm making it such a big deal. And plus he's cute. Like who doesn't like a cute little fluffy dog? Um, so, um, I'm sure you know, like I said earlier a million times in a video, Drake is six and he's been with me since um, he was like eight or nine weeks old. And yeah, he's been my, my road dog, literally. He's been through everything. And you just interrupted my film. Come in. Come, in. Come in and say hello. Oh, now you wanna be shy. All right, so. Sorry for the interruption. He pretends like he doesn't want to be filmed, but I think he's getting his feet wet. So he'll he'll be in a few episodes. That's my husband, Daniel. Um, so but yeah, with Drake, I've had him ever since he was a puppy, and he's just been my little buddy. Um, and it's just so funny that I still have him because if you know me, you know that I try to get rid of him. Now, before you judge me, Drake was very headstrong as a puppy. He would do things like tear my homework up, um, pee on top of my book bag. He would pee on my good rugs. And mind you, I know you're like, oh, well, he was a puppy. No, when I got Drake, he was trained. Okay, he was literally trained the day that I picked him up to the puppy pad. So the um, breeder that I got him from, she trained him to the puppy pad and at five o'clock in the morning, he was trained to like cry basically to let you know that he had to use the restroom. And that's exactly what he did. Cause I remember the first day that I brought him home, it was 4.45 in the morning and he was the quietest puppy. And that's another reason why I really liked him. He was just like super quiet and just cuddly and cute. So I was like, what is that noise? It was Drake. And then like 
I remember he started like increasing in volume because I, when I sleep, I'm dead sleep. So eventually he got to like barking. At first it was like a cute little like cry, but yeah, around, I mean, I remember it was like 4.45 in the morning. So Drake is very smart. He is a smart dog. And um, that is why I know like he can catch an attitude. He can catch a, an attitude, y'all. Um, so yeah, I just remember that about him as a puppy. And um, just like chewing up stuff, chewing up my belts, chewing up my shoes. And he has so many dog toys and just like everything. Like when I bought him, I had done a lot of research because I knew I wanted a black dog. Um, so I did a lot of research on the type of dog I wanted, like the breed, everything. So when I found him, I was fully prepared to take him home. So Drake was spoiled as a puppy, y'all. Don't get it twisted. All right. Um, and he's still spoiled to this day, but it's because he just has so much personality and he's just so fun. He's just like a fun little old man. Um, and the best part about Drake is that he can like sense your mood. So I remember that um, when I'd be sad and I'd be crying, he'd come and he'd like lick my face and just like snuggle with me. So that is why I am celebrating Drake. But other than that, hopefully you all enjoyed the vlog. Um, but I'm going to wrap this up. This is going to be like my outro. And I just wanted to get on here um, and sit down with y'all. Because you see, I had to put my face on. And if you're wondering if these glasses have... Um, there's no glass. <laughs> it's just because it's cute. But yeah, I just wanted to get on here and give y'all a little razzle dazzle, a little little look. Um, Cause I know that's what you're here for, right? But yeah, hopefully you enjoy the video. I think for the next video, what we're going to do is we're going to go camping. I'm super excited. It'll be like the second time I've ever gone camping. So we're going to vlog that and um, yeah, stay tuned for next week. All right, y'all. But I'm about to run, probably go lay down because I need a nap after all that. Um, and then probably watch some like YouTube because I, I love YouTube or maybe Netflix. So let me know if there's any good shows out there. I kind of want to start watching some scary movies, but I'm really scared to watch scary movies by myself. And Daniel really doesn't like scary movies either. So um, I don't know if there's any good movies, you know, with fall coming in. I kind of want to watch something, you know, like that sus suspense or thriller, maybe. Um, and just like get some snacks and a nice, like cozy blanket. I do live in Vegas, though, so I we'll probably won't be doing the cozy blanket. But I just want the vibes, like the fall vibes which is what I'm trying to serve y'all with this, you know, this yellow. And then like, I don't know if you can tell, but my shadow is like red and maroon. But um, yeah, probably just hang out for the rest of this weekend. And I have work stuff to do still. Um, so I'll probably try to get ahead of that because that stuff is due this coming week. Like I can't even enjoy my long weekend but that's a whole nother vlog. We're not going to get into it today. Um, so yeah, just let me know um, what else y'all want to see. I have a few ideas for y'all, which I'm really excited about. Like I said, camping probably next weekend, if not next weekend, then the following. But um, yeah, stay tuned. Thanks for tuning in. Go ahead and hit that like button and subscribe. Leave a comment. Bye.